life on Mother Earth. We see some, all kinds of things growing, trees and, and animals, insects, birds, all have life. So when we, <clears throat> our people a long time ago start searching for different kinds of food to live by, and they, they decided that some of the ones that they uh, tasted would be proper, like different animals, different kinds of fish they got out of the rivers. They, in, in my time that I remember that our people used to use most of the fish that came out of the water because they were, they were told that they, that they, were, they were pure. I remember when I was a young boy, I, I used to eat suckers and different kinds of fish. And I'm still alive. And I, I, I used to fish for suckers. I used to fish for chisel mouth and, and white fish and all these other kinds of fish. So there, again, our people were told that all these things were edible. But then we go and take another step and we go to different kinds of uh, meat. Some of the meat uh, uh, are not right to eat, but they, they experimented. They found the ones and, and, uh, and mostly the ones that were, are, were like, they give their life to us. We can see them and then they, they, they stand still. And, Say, well, just like, take me, I'll, I'll feed you. So there, they, again, they had so much respect for the uh, different animals that they, uh, they used uh, uh, quite a bit of it, just about all of the, like they like. For an instance, take a deer or an elk, just about everything on that animal is used. All the way from the, like the antlers, uh, different uh, the hide made a lot of uh, clothing, and how to process all that. All gifts from our Mother Earth. They used this uh, and and uh, figured out a way how to make uh, oak skin. You know, it's a, it's not an easy process. It takes a lot of patience, but that's one thing our people had is a lot of patience. 